want to say one thing. People are so fucking stupid. So fucking. They're idiots. They're, they're fucking idiots. A 15-year-old girl was gang raped in California. It fucking makes me sick to my stomach. Not only was she raped for two and a half hours, she was there being raped while people were watching. They're saying at least 10 to 15 people were sitting there watching as early reports. What kind of moral values do you have to not say anything and to not go get help? And what kind of fucking security does a school have if people behind the school are getting raped? There is no security behind the school, no nothing. She was led behind the school in an alley, and she was gang raped. No one knew a thing about it. Absolutely no one. How does this shit happen? These teens had cell phones. The people that were watching, they had phones. And if they didn't, they're lying. I mean, I don't want to put people, words in people's mouths, but... Out of ten people, how many of those people do you think had cell phones? I'd say at least 70% of those people had cell phones. Or 70% of those people probably had some common sense and they could have gone and done something. Now, I, how do you not call 911? And here's the most disgusting part about it. The peop these people that were watching, some of these people ended up participating in the rape. Alright, so I just got my tires done. Um, <laughs> I feel pretty safe now in my car, now that I have tires that can handle the snow and actually I have tread on them, so <laughs> feels pretty good actually. I'm just really happy. They're supposed to last for about 70,000 miles, which is going to be, well, I don't know. They're going to last me a long time though. They should last me four or five years, I hope. Um, it didn't cost me that much. I mean, it was only 350 bucks for four tires really fucking good so I'm happy I'm about ready to go have lunch with my mom um, I'm gonna throw on some tunes here and uh, head out hey um, I just got done so um, I sh what's that um, I can come over there if you want alright sounds good bye so I just got out of lunch with my mom. Awesome stuff. Had some Indian food. And now I gotta go to Walmart and uh, get some stuff. Some cups, um, a laundry bag, and little things. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Right, who knows who this is? Anyone know? It's a movie, a really, really awesome movie. You guys have to know, come on. Any guesses? Post a comment below. Alright guys, so just leaving Walmart. I don't know if you guys can see the sign behind me, but... That's where I'm leaving from right now. And uh, I got what I needed. I got my laundry bag, um, a hat cage for the hat I'm wearing so I can clean it when I go to my mom's tonight. And um, think here for a second. All right, sorry about that, guys. Just got to get out of that parking lot. Um, I got my laundry bag and some silverware. I got uh, cups. I really needed cups. I only had like, I think a total of four cups and I just picked up six more. So I'm kind of happy about that. <laughs> I don't have to do a dishwasher every two or three years. I can just rinse them out and clean them and clean them with my um, sponge and stuff without <laughs> running the goddamn dishwasher all the time. So I think someone just fell over. <laughs> I don't 
mean to laugh. It's just, it was just uh, kind of random. See? Yeah. See, now they're, now they're walking away. <laughs> kind of cool. I think they were just playing, but it's kind of cool. Uh, going to my mom's here in about three or four hours. Um, it's about a 20 minute, 30 minute drive down there. So I eat dinner and do my laundry every week. Um, it's, it's worth it because I also, I get dinner, plus I can do my laundry um, for free. And it costs me just as much doing it here as it is to drive down there. So. I, I figure it's more worth it to do it that way, and I guess see my parents more. Across the universe I was listening to. It's a fantastic movie and the soundtrack rocks. Across the universe is a musical, so if you guys love musicals, you'll love this. So I'm back home now and I am ready to go inside and unload all my groceries, sort of. I guess they really aren't groceries, they're more of things I need around the house. Been to my mom's now, so I will see you guys when I get there. Should be about half an hour, um, one second waiting time for you guys. All right, so I am uh, five or six minutes away from my mom and stepdad's house. Um, I can't really show you anything right now because I'm driving, and there's not really anything to see. But so, unless you guys want to see cooler fields, I got better stuff. So I'm here, and we gotta just get inside and get my laundry down, and I will show you guys around. What's she doing, Sushaf? Playing with my phone. That's not a phone, that's a tambour. Hey, <laughs> you're smart. Apparently, he's a lot smarter than I thought. Don't oh. beat up your panda. That's not, not down there. Ah! <laughs> ah here's the barn. There's the house. Ah, oh, man. Cold out here. Very, very Hey Fuzzy Bear. I forgot your name. I forgot your name. Here's cats galore. More cats. Another cat. I'm not sure. I think she's sick and my uncle's trying to get her better, but <laughs> Hey I know you. Callie, come back here. Kelly. <laughs> These are all my uncle's cats, stray cats that he's took in like over 15, 16 years. I mean, he's been doing this for a long time. He says that uh, he won't take any more of him, but every time he says that, a year later he has like five more. <laughs> Maybe you should watch Scooby. <laughs> Chloe. What are you doing, Missy? Sinky. Hanky. What's up? What's up, Frank? Come on, Frank. Come on. Come on, Frank. Uh, oh well. We'll see you next week, Frankie. See you next week.